What is up everyone and welcome back to more Devil May Cry. He's kind of like, sup, I'm really cool. You know, I'm just going to go out there and say this. Obviously, it's a Capcom game, but I don't know why, but when I look at Dante, I see Leon a little bit, like a white haired Leon. Anyone else? Just me? I don't know. I kind of see it. Anyways, I want to go into my files because in the first episode or maybe the second episode, I was kind of reading up on who these enemies are and I did the first three. So let's have a look at Sin Scythe. These evil spirits have scythes instead of scissors. Like the Sin Sisters, oh my gosh, that's a lot of S's. They are dependent on their masks. They cannot exist without them. The large spinning attack with the scythe is an expression of the sin's hatred and anger. You have to be quick on your feet to evade the returning scythe of the boomerang scythe attacks. What's with all the, the gaps? The scythes that fly at you can be deflected with your guns if you engage the devil trigger. Guns are very effective against these evil spirits since they've only fought with the ancient knights who only use swords. Use your guns to blast them out of the air. Death scissors. The part of the part that looks like a cow's bone is their main body. Their evil is much stronger and tougher when compared to the sins. They use many staff staffs made from bones of animals and humans to create an evil barrier. This barrier is impenetrable. You must defeat the enemy within it. Their screw attacks are accurate and very destructive. Dodge to escape these attacks. It's unwise to try to fight these evil spirits from surface. Become a devil hunter and take the fight into air. The head of the main body is their weak point, but regular guns won't have much effect against it. Their capes are nothing more than illusions created by the evil spirits. All physical attacks are useless. Oh. They are more powerful than the sins. They will most likely counter Dante's attacks by deflecting his attacks. When they concentrate evil in their hands, their heads turn red, and all of your attacks become ineffective. When you are caught in this situation, do your best to dodge their attacks. I don't even remember fighting the death scissors. Maybe that was just in one of the last couple of missions, but I, I don't really remember. So I'll read one more, and then maybe in the next episode we can go through some more of the enemies. So the shadow. It has evil spells covering its body, thus allowing it to deflect all sword attacks. It's an evil spirit that takes form from its own shadows, but they can also take on other forms by changing the spells on its body. When you damage its surface to a certain point, it will come to a point when it can't deflect the attacks anymore. Showing its true form, this is when it is most vulnerable. So when it becomes like the ball, basically. Its spinning attack is very accurate. Watch out for it when it jumps high into the air. Beel Zebub. Oh! I remember when we fought those. Okay, I'll read this one and then I'll do the, ne the rest next time. This evil spirit inhabits the body of a fly. Their hideousness is not too difficult to imagine from its appearance and movements. The large green Beelzebubs serve like an evil power bank for the blue airborne Beelzebubs. They seem to be stronger since they have larger physical mass. The green bubs eat the dead, absorb their evil powers, and become even stronger. After absorbing, absorbing, they gain more agility and thus more dangerous. When it is hit and on its back, this is when it's most vulnerable. Blast it with an aerial attack. Also watch out for the poison it spurts out. Alright, let's move on, shall we? So this is the bridge that I put down earlier. Oh, okay, well, it looks like we're not going back to the castle anytime soon. That's okay, I just wanted to leave anyway. What? Oh, oh, that's my friend. <laughs> I was like, who is this guy and what are you doing here? So I only have 49, so it's, it's not even worth speaking to you. You're not worth my time. 
There's a message carved in the stone. It seems to be a story of some kind. Destiny awaits. Somewhere deep in the Colosseum. Hmm. Alright, well we must be moving on to like the next segment of the game. I think we are pretty much done with the castle. So that's fine, I guess. I did enjoy the castle. It was like a nice introduction to the game. Longest stairs ever. So where is my lead? Li my lead? Where is my lead? Whoa! My lady friend. What the heck are these things? Hi! How you doing? Well, that was good. Cool, dude! I think I got them all. And I think this gun is super effective with those guys, that's for sure. So we seem to have like a bunch of different ways to go. So I'm to make sure I get everything. What are these? Um, That looks like that potentially is the Colosseum, but I don't know if I want to go in there yet. It's sealed shut from the other side. Oh. Holy water. Water of divine blessings. It holds the power to eliminate all the evil that's around you. Hey, that might have been quite nice against these guys. So uh, we're obviously going to come back this way at some point. That's why that door is there. Look at this place. It's crazy. So we came in from that way. So what is down here? There's something up there. There's an emblem of a shield on the door that glows with red light. Okay. Give me this. Hey, hey. And this. There's a decoration resembling two knights. It appears as though the knights should be holding something. Words are carved. Beneath the decoration. Oh, sorry. <laughs> the words are carved beneath the decoration. The shields that glow with light and a pair of lances shall lead to the battleground. Okay, so I need to get some lances. Yup. So now we have a purple shield. There's an emblem of a shield. Oh, that's blue? I'm sorry, that is purple. You cannot convince me otherwise. Words are carved here. A pair of flames that dwell with strength will open the path. Ah, come on, that would have given it some good flames. Surely. Alright, well I feel like there's nothing I can do there. Yet. Oh god. Um, there's a bunch of ladders here. This gate must have led to the outside, but it's been destroyed. And that means I can't go through. But you know what? That's really annoying. Can I get up here? Really? There's ladders here though. Thank you. It's very quiet. I don't like it. What does that give me? A crystal with magical powers. It will recover fire devil trigger gauges. Very nice. Now let's go and try on the other side and see. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What is this? What is this? Don't do that! Okay, then.
then. I don't know how long that's gonna last for, but I just wanna go around here first. It probably doesn't last for too long. Yes, oh my gosh! Are you seeing this? I have five of those things. I'm like a boss. Yeah, boy. Now, is this gonna switch off? It doesn't seem like it's gonna switch off. Okay. Um, this is gonna be fun. Okay, thank you, camera angles. <laughs> um. Do where where? Where and why? Okay, that makes more sense. I was like, am I gonna really jump from that other one? There's an inscription on the base. My name is Ifrit. <gasps> the fool who awakens me shall pay dearly with the fires of hell. Yeah, well, I got Shiva on my side, so. Um. Okay, a flaming gauntlet that gives the possessor increased powers. Okay, can I get like a tutorial on this? Hold the phone. Devil arms. You can select your devil trigger items. Okay, so is that just in, obviously that's instead of guns. Do I get like all sorts of different moves? Whoa! Yeah boy. Okay, so I think I just leave. Doink. <gasps> All right, devil arms, do your stuff. Oh. Oh, never mind. I mean, I wanted it to do its stuff, but, you know, it squished. Doink. Okay. Don't mess with me. I have the power of Ifrit. I kind of thought that, like, maybe something bad was gonna happen. Like, I was gonna fight Ifrit, but. Nope. Apparently not.
stupid bird. Stupid bird. But I feel like I would rather put on um, this because it gives me like aerial capabilities as well, you know? by accident. I think I did. Um, so I'm probably gonna have to use a pair of flames that dwell with strength will open the path. So, okay. Let's put these back on. I don't know, I just, I felt like they weren't like the greatest. I don't know. Ah, there we go. Okie dokies. Hey, this is cool. Although I can't see anything, but it's kind of cool. Oh, don't come back, please. What the heck? Ah! Puppets everywhere! What is that one? Is that like an explodey puppet? What? I can't even see it from here. Coming from down here. Whoa! Uh oh. That's like the worst camera angle for that. Okay. I like how it's like, Susie, 
Basically, the way you're playing the game is dull. And I'm like, I don't care. Do you see me killing things? Because I see me killing things. And that's all that matters. Things be dying, okay? Don't give me a massive grenade launcher and then... Shit, that made me shit myself. And then, like, not expect me to use it. So now I can do up Ifrit too. Charge power and release it in the form of magma uppercut. A quick but powerful flaming back roundhouse kick. Its impact will drive the enemy back. Okay. Can't do any of those. Let's go for this one. Because why the heck not? These levels are getting longer and longer. And I don't like it. I don't trust it. Huh. I didn't know. Oh, hey, buddy. I didn't know that I could destroy graves. Whoa! Nelly Potato. Oh, hey, buddy. Don't, don't expect to come back swinging. Oh my god. Are you okay, Finny? Expertly doge. Oh my god, they just... They just keep coming! today. Oh yeah, give me that, give me that. Another yellow orb. At one point today, I was really struggling to have a bunch of those, whereas now I just seem to have, have them constantly. Devil star. What are these things for? Oh. Oh. I did I did not know that that was a thing that you could punch those. What the fuck? God say. Huh. Okay. I thought we were done here, but it turns out we're not. I don't think I can... Oh! I didn't know that I even needed that many orbs, but okay. That's kind of shady. Thanks, game. <laughs> I wanted them for other things. Oh man. That was a really long mission. That was like almost an entire video for one mission. Bird of Prey. That was fun though. I really enjoyed that. That's okay. Right, let's go ahead and save it. Canyon of Mist. Come out of the Labyrinth Canyon alive. Ooh. Um, I think I'm gonna save all of these just for, actually no, let's get this do is um upgrading some of my stuff hey 
right, this is pretty. Hey, buddy. Oh my gosh. That's a lot of them. Okay, let's actually go ahead and... Let's put on the shotgun. I'm missing my shotgun right now. Taking me back. What? I guess I'll have to try again. What? Okay, I'm assuming I'm not going that way then. And all the enemies will be back. Of course. But of course. I didn't think that maybe I'd gone the wrong way. of some kind. Valley of the Mist. One must choose the right path to enter the Lost Land. Only those who protect the weak light shall have the power to decipher the right path. Oh no! Okay, this is weird. This is really weird. I'm obviously not understanding the riddle. Maybe I should take out all of the enemies. Like... Maybe that's a thing. taken everything out but I don't it's a riddle of some kind valley of the mist one must choose the right path to enter the lost land only those who protect the weak Okay, so I followed the light. So basically I need to take everything out.
That laugh is like awful. just kills everything around you. Okay, I've never used that before, so I just wanted to see what it would do. So now, is this the... the Colosseum thing? So I had to kill both of these guys. Oh, I cheated! I totally cheated just then. <laughs> nice! That was fun, but I was confused. I was like, welcome. I got a C, but like, at one point I got a Bravo, so I'm kind of happy about that. <laughs> right, let's go ahead and save it. It saves so fast, it's crazy. Fate. Offer the chalice and open the path. So I can't get any of those. I feel like... It's kind of cheating, but like, I like it. What's a blue orb again? Oh yeah, we should be getting those so that we can get more life. I just got here! beep <laughs> give me all this thank you very much I will say 
this ifrit thing, it's really good. Okay, there's a lot of stuff. Oh. Gimme. No! Ah. Ah. Gimme the goodies! Hey, there's a hole down there. I wonder if I could fall down there. What? Well, for one, I feel like I should have been able to grab this thing. Aha, uh -huh, there we go. There's something in there. Okay, so that's me got this one. Yep. What the heck, it's like... Stuff hidden everywhere. Can I go down here? Ooh! What is this? There's light pouring out through the crack of the wall. Uh huh. I did not see them! I did not see them until like the last freaking second. Okay, we're getting pretty close to be able to do that. Okay, so I've got nothing for that just now. Let's power up! Ba -da -bim, bim, 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 bim. Is that it? Oh. Hey! That's another one. Oh no! A taxidermic organ coated by crystal. Within it is the sign of chastity. That's necessary for searching for chalice. Oh. Hold on, I gotta get up here. Surely. Surely. Oh. Weird. You're kidding me! Are you fucking kidding me? Get me the fuck out of here! Okay. Well, at least nice and quiet now, I suppose. Okay, let's see if I can get on the other side. So I've done this one. Definitely get up there. Hundred and ten percent. I also think that you can get over that way too, look. Really? It looks like there's an opening in that. Oh hey. Take that. Okay, so now, <laughs> third time's a charm. It's just there's a blue thing in there, and ultimately the blue things give you more HP. So I am all down for more HP. My gun is clipping through my jacket. Fudge! Fine, you know what? Let's just leave it for just now. What's down here? What is this? 
There's a cup on the base protected by a powerful light. Prove yourself worthy with the sign. Should I use the sign? Okay. The cup which held the blood of the divine dead. Uh, what? Oh, dude, not you again. Dude, we already fought. What? This is like the worst place to fight. Hello? I can't even see him! Okay, this is a joke! Oh, thank you! Oh my god. Oh my god. Stop. Stop. Stop, 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 stop. Okay, I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready. Uh, crystal with magical powers. Let me go. The entrance is sealed, so I guess I can't go back this way. I was a little bit concerned just then. But, 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 we managed. Right, how do I get out? Um, okay, I didn't know I could come up here. But, uh,. Here we are, so. Do I need that health? I don't think I do. It's a gold statue of a knight. It looks like something was placed here. Should I use, yes. Where was that? Was that out the front? Or was that up top? I didn't like get much of a chance to actually explore this room. Oh, maybe it was down here. There we go. Whew. That guy though. All right. I wonder if we'll see him again. Maybe not. Broken halo. I'm having so much fun. 
Oh, that's a bad rank, though. I did use the, the gun a lot in that one. But hey, if it's in the game, I can use it. So, let's save. 237, 11 saves. Next mission. Oh, God. Go to the deck and head up to the captain's cabin. Uh, got a thousand. What's this? Shoot fireballs from the fists. Yes. Yes, please. Thank you very much. Okay. Let's power up. Underwater controls? Are you kidding me? You cannot use your devil trigger. It quickly changes the view to the direction that the left stick is being pressed. Check. Swim. When you have the underwater gun equipped, press R1. They're based on normal mode. Ew! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? What is worse than a normal level? An underwater level. The joys. Alright guys, I'm gonna go ahead and stop this episode here, so thank you so much for watching and I will see you all in the next episode. Bye!